clearly a stair block above it. Uh, we have a one-hit wonder. Fantastic. Don't really need it. Efficiency 3 gold. Some more arrows to top off. And some more gunpowder to top off. And I don't need this or that. Oh, and we have golden apples. Sweet. Plenty of golden apples. Um, I'll come back for this stuff if I need it, but none of it is really spectacular. Um, I mean, this is like two and a half gold uh, gold blocks. Uh, it's nice not to have to mine it out of the uh, wall, but it's only two and a half gold blocks. It's not that helpful. Uh, let's put the... what are we going to put on the bar? I guess instant health absorption. Because now we're going to take on the arachnid death machines. Press E, please. Which are, um, death. They're, they're really bad. Like, I, I don't like them. I realize, though, that uh, a Bane of Arthropods would be amazing against them, as those are the three mobs in the game that are affected by Bane of Arthropods. Um, Endermites, I'm not sure if they're affected by Bane of Arthropods yet. Uh, I haven't read up on that, like what they're classified as. Um, they might just be classified as nothing, or as Endermen, and affected or bad by only water. But anywho. I critted you. Will you die? Ah, you will. Fantastic. Oh, and you, you're, you died kindly. You gave me an iron. It's also very nice. Very nice of you. Um, okay. Let's do that. And let's make these four coal into torches so I can free up another slot. Fantastic. Alright, let's just go for it. I'm going to die terribly. Hi, Creeper. I want to get to that chest, please. Oh, there's another creeper over there. Knockback one, speed 12 minutes. Actually, I don't need that speed. Because I already have speed one infinitely. So that's fine. Uh, take out all these skeletons so they don't punch me down the hill. Alright, let's go. Um, I think there's an, an arachnid death machine up here. Or I'm guessing there is. Yep, there's one. Oh jeez. Alright, back off now. Back off. Back off. Back off. Ah! Alright, that's fine. That's fine. That was not a torch. Die. You're not even near me. Don't even try. Okay. Um, we have a skeleton who's now dead. Baby zombie who's trying to avoid being shot to death. I admire I admire that. It's very nice of him. Or well, very he has a survival instinct, let's put it that way. It's not really nice of him to avoid death for me anyway. Don't you try to do that. I can knock you away. Or kill you. Or both. Uh die. Die. Oh jeez. Oh okay, the creeper died. I thought he hit me into the creeper. Okay. Let's take this out really quickly. Good. Fantastic. Oh, a chest blew up. Don't you blow up the things. There's diamond pants that I really want from that pile. Die. All the mobs. Uh, there's an enderman that's just... I see over there. Don't pick up my pants! Skeleton, go away! <sighs> Die. Oh, jeez, all the mobs down there. Um, I might want to reclaim... Actually, I think I have a lava bucket. Uh, I'm not regenning. Oh, jeez. Okay, he didn't blow up the diamond pants. Um, that's not what I wanted. I want... Eh. There we go. I wanted the chest. Fantastic. Die. Jesus. All of these mobs. Oh, there's a spawner. Alright, it's gone now. 
Don't you blow. Stop. Just just let me let me see what these pants are in peace. Oh god. This area. It's just it's just non stop. One mob at a time. And then you hit a zombie and then they're all aggroed from the area down there where they spawn. I'm probably in range of a zombie spawner too. That would be uh not surprising to me. Uh we have fire protection and unbreaking. Meh. Yeah. Not not spectacular. Not spectacular in the least. Anything behind this chain or under it? No. Okay. Um, it looks like we have some stone block that is uh weird all over the walls. Um and there's a death fortress, if I've ever seen one. Uh huh. And there's probably something under here as well. Oh geez. Okay. He doesn't know that I looked at him. I just took a sneak peek. Don't worry, Mr. Enderman. I I didn't mean to. Yes, I did. Ouch! Stop it. You're dead. Um, let's put more torches on the bar, and let's get down here and light this up. Creepers, don't do it! Oh jeez, they did it. Although I can really tank blast resistance with my one chest plate. Die. Ah! But they're getting rid of my lighting, which is like the only issue here. Ah! Okay, alright. Hey, hey, whatever's hitting me, stab! Oh, endermite. Oh, those things actually hit you. That's interesting. That's that's cool. That's I I I kind of like that feature. Like the enemy teleports away, and you still have something to attack. Uh, cause the enemy might de-aggro, you know. And it is three blocks tall. I like that actually. Okay, I don't need you or you or you. Get out of my life. I want to top of my torches. Stop shooting me. Alright. There's nothing down in this hole. Um, right? Nothing? No. Nothing. At least, like, put, like, a couple spawners here. Zombie spawners. Just two zombie spawners so that they aggro on, on you when you're up there, you know? Just, just, while you're up here looking through the diamond chest, and you're like, oh, a diamond chest, and you're looking at the area, and you're like, huh, I wonder what that is. Just zombie spawners, so that they come up and bring all their friends. That That's what you need there, Tikaro. It's simple, it's easy, and it's not overpowered. I didn't look at you. Um, yeah. There's another spider spawner down there as well. Um... And what are these boots? Feather falling, I don't need them. Get out of my life! Get out of my life. All these things I don't need. Um, yeah. Ooh, okay. I was thinking about placing the lava bucket over the arachnid death machine, but then they're gonna just hit me in there because they hit very hard. I don't know if that's lit up enough by that fire to reduce the spawning at all, but I'm going to try to get in there and mitigate it as much as possible. Oh jeez, this is not an arachnid death machine. Or at least it looked like a mushroom or something. Um, I appreciate not getting hit into oblivion. Mr. Skellies and creepers and spiders. Oh jeez. I think I saw one of the spiders and I don't think it's happy. Die. Die. Ah, uh, it's not happy. It's not happy. It's not happy. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it with fire. <laughs> Stop. Go right. Run. Okay. We're fine. Everything's fine. Kill with fire. It's still coming. Oh, no. Go away. Go away. Go away. Jesus. I hate. I hate them. <laughs> They're terrible. Oh, God. You can't hit them. You have to. You have to like put a block between you and them, or it's just game over. Die, Jesus! I'm not regenerating either. I really need to be. Okay, 
That's two extra hearts that I need. You're dead. Come here. Come here. Come here, you. Okay. Uh, let's go over here and light up this so I can safely get back. And what is this? Stone? Yeah, that's that weird stone tile thing. Okay. Great. So now, we're nice and safe and lit up. Uh, and there's no arachnid... Oh god, there's still one. Um, please don't kill me. Thank you. Uh, 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 I hate that. Eternal Equilibrium, Area 1 of 3, Tears of Abundance. I guess that's with all the water. Stop! I want to read the sign. <laughs> uh, Eternal Equilibrium, Area 2 of 3, The War... World... World... The World Rim Citadel. The Rim of the World. God, that's a that's a tongue twister and a half. W world w World Rim Citadel. Don't you flash at me? That creeper flashed me in a uh, in an interesting way. Uh, more torches. Don't need that. Or that. Or that. Or that. Is it Mr. Zombie? I see you. Don't push me. Oh, geez. I pressed F1. Uh, uh, there we go. Uh, we have an area that is very dark. So let's just light up the center of this and we'll leave the size of the cavern to spawn mobs. Um, so that it, they don't all spawn here. Let's also light up this over here. Just so I don't have skeletons behind me. Uh, I don't need these on the bar. I'll take these potions, especially because there's fire. Die. And die. Die. Uh, we have infinite redstone now, although I think we had that since intersection 1. Um. That that weird that square looks weird. I wonder if that's a secret. Just how square it is. Like everything else is very rounded and that's just like a square. I don't think that's a secret, but it might be. Never know. Uh we have a gas citadel. We have a suspicious water pillar over in the back. Uh what looks like an ice spike right there. That's also interesting. Other than that, it's just an ominous bridge. Um, yeah, there's not much to the walls of the cavern, and of course it is nighttime. Anything up there? Secret? Uh, not that I can tell. Okay. Well, I don't see any uh, skellies just yet, so let's go ahead and bridge here. And you are not even going to get close to me. Um, yeah, let's just make this the safe part here. Uh-huh. Fantastic. So now we have a nice, wide cobble bridge to retreat upon as soon as we activate all of those lovely gas spawners over there. Um, how do we want to attack this? Uh, through the main gate is like the only route of attack. I could go up there and then throw an ender pearl. Actually, I could throw an ender pearl straight up and land on top of the thing. But those spawners, I don't know what they are. Uh, the ones hidden right there behind the pillars. You see that little cage? I imagine they're blaze spawners, but they could be anything. Um,. That's regen two. That's fine. Let's make some more torches here. Another stack for now. 
And let's get rid of this and this. And I don't need all that gunpowder. Or that. Actually, let's make another... Let's make some more torches here. Um, that many. Sure. Why not? Just because I might not have room for error once I'm in there. Alright, so there's a staircase near the back. Uh, and there's two spawners right in the middle of that room. Which I imagine since this is sandstone and it is charge creepers. And there, there is uh, just lava underneath the castle. Uh, what do I have that could help me with this? Strength 2. We're going to drink that. And we're going to have an absorption apple. And put blocks on the bar. Alright, let's go. Uh, let's just go for this. I don't... Alright, I'm not activating that gas spawner. There's a creeper. It's not charged, though. Uh, we have wither death things spawning there. I hear invisible blazes. Oh, those are those things from the first uh, area. Ooh, what's hitting me? Silverfish? Okay. That's cool, I guess. Stop. Oh, let's kill... Oh, jeez, Enderman. I hear ladders. Wow, you're dead very quickly. Uh, there's more silverfish coming from the area to the left. Actually, where are the sil where's the silver spawner? Because that does not is not affected by light levels. I imagine it's somewhere right here. No, all right, maybe not. Um, there's a ledge above me for that creeper to come down and have fun. Uh, while I still have strength, let's keep moving on. Here. A solid ladder well. Tickero. Tickero, there's not a single broken ladder in that well. You broke the floor, alright? The floor is broken, but this ladder well is perfectly solid. Oh my god, just. Uh, th I think that's gonna be the name of this episode. Solid ladder wells. If I can remember that while, uh. while editing. Yeah, as I suspected, the floor is very thin and has uh, lava underneath it. There's the silverfish spawner. I like this little thing here. That's very nice. Uh, we have another ladder well, strangely not broken. And a barricade. Okay. I guess the barricade is for those charged creepers to protect the ladder a little bit. Oh, jeez. Okay, we're under the castle now. Um, is there anything down here other than lava? Does not look like it. Yeah, no. Okay, let's get back up there. I almost went through the ceiling, and we are close enough to the gas... Oh, jeez, he exploded the whole th world, didn't he? Alright. I'm close enough to the gas uh, to spawn them, so let's get onto the roof quickly. Through any means necessary to take out this gas spawner. And... I will be right back, because I think that was the door.